Good to see you again my lovely friends we are back to showcase how we turned one of the most niche augments into a winning move on Yumi in the arena. So let's get to it. To start off we get our starting item the Guardian's Amulet that will help us in the early game by giving us 20% heal and shield power. Now as we get into our first match I must preface we only play Yumi because she is the best and most fun champion in my opinion. Now we head on in with our random mate Singed and for the first round of Wait Out The Clock we do wonders. Unfortunately for us our Singe decides to hit us into the ring of fire and take 3 ticks of damage. However even after all that work Singe put in it's now up to us to clutch the round. Amazing. After our stunning first round victory it's time to choose an augment and after not seeing anything interesting we take a chance and reroll to find something of more use. We do we get Sonic Boom. This damages nearby enemies whenever we heal or shield singed. Into the second battle we go. We are up against Leona and Quinn. A tough matchup for sure how will we come out? Not good. No point in wasting time, a quick death awaits. Ah, uh, now we see what made them so hard to tackle. Leona has the castle augment so she can swap places with Quinn as we saw in the battle. Brutal. For battle 3, we are up against Morgana and Kale. We struggle from the start. Yay gold. Now time to buy something to help out the team. What should we get? Oh, this will be perfect. For battle number four, we are up against Mordekaiser and Dr. Mundo again. Can we win again? Oh. Oh. 
So close. Here it is augment selection number two. We again take a chance and reroll, and we strike gold in the form of the Apex Investor Augment. This augment gives us 300% item haste. This will be very useful later. Now for battle number five. We are once again up against Leona and Quinn. And judging from the amount of damage Leona is mitigating ill wager, we don't win this round. I was right. We get enough gold to buy a redemption. This purchase is really great for us as we have the Apex Investor Augment allowing us to get off a few redemptions per battle. <laughs> On to battle number 6. How will we fare versus Kale and Morgana now that we have the powerful redemption? They stand no chance. Once again, we get more gold this time enough to sell our damage item and get us some powerful heal and shield items to work better with the Apex Investor Augment. The Apex Investor Augment is putting in work. Now let's see if our three use items and 75% cool down on them can help us best Leona and Quinn in battle number seven. As you can see even the powerful duo of Leona and Quinn fall easily to my used items and how much I could use them. Now we get a look at the final augment selection and we pick what can only be described as by synergy. For the augment we pick up does not reduce the cooldown of our items but instead whenever we hit an enemy with our ability they are burned and that burn reduces the cooldown of our abilities so we can cast more Q and E spells. And into battle 8 we go. Up against Mordekaiser and Dr. Mundo for the third time. We are ready for Mordekaiser R and the 1v1 we enter so we throw down our redemption and pop our locket shield and try and stay alive for Cinch to get back to the mortal realm. Once Mordekaiser is dead, it's not a cakewalk just yet. We have to kite our Dr. Mundo R. Close one, we were out of mana. We get more gold and buy ourselves some anti-heal to deal with the Dr. Mundo a little bit. For Battle 9, we fight a good fight against Leona and Quinn.
took long enough. We go to the shop with more gold and sell our boots. Now the only useful stat we were gaining from them was ability haste, but with the item we replace them with we get more than ability haste making up for it more than enough. We get to sit out this next round because there is an odd number of teams left. Why bother spectating? Bonk. For our final augment, we mark enemies with our abilities to deal damage when Singe damages them. Now we just have to survive. We part ways with our guardian's amulet and say hello to Abyssal Mask. And now for the final battle. Let's see if we can win. And Boom Singed has made a wall that wins us the game. Thanks for watching. I love you so much. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you again soon.